What's up guys, welcome back to another video. So today we're gonna be reviewing a new product from Billy Bars. We're gonna be installing crossbars on the bed that are tunnel cover compatible so that I could uh, mount a rooftop tent on this and do some adventuring. And uh, let's get to it. So these are the Billy Bars crossbars. These guys are awesome and they sent me a set of eight inch bars that uh, we're about to install. So they're aluminum with T-Track. It's the T-Track. These seem solid. And I already opened this just to check it out. So these are the mounting brackets. These are the eight inch. So pretty much this is the one of the only only uh, crossbars that work with a tunnel cover. There's probably one more company out there, but Billy Bars look like they have the best quality. So let me show you guys right here. So these mount like that under the tunnel cover, and then the bars go across it. So there is only one small issue with this type of tunnel cover that I have. Mine's the low profile one, and the low profile, if you guys look, usually they either clamp, usually the tunnel covers clamp from the top, C-clamps like that. This one actually clamps onto the rail, if you see right here, so it clamps from the side. And I'll show you guys in a bit, I'm gonna take these off, and I'll show you what we're gonna be doing to make these work. Hopefully it works. If it doesn't work, we're gonna have to get a new tunnel cover. But stay tuned. So first things first, we're gonna loosen these clamps. Okay. And let me show you guys what I was talking about. So if you look, these are gonna mount just like that. And the only issue is, if you guys can see, it's kind of hard to tell. But this right here is like a T. So this piece of aluminum right here, this L, L channel aluminum is in our way. What we're gonna try to do is notch out wherever these, uh, brackets go we're gonna try to notch out around it and then slide it in all the way so it sits flush so I'm gonna go ahead and disassemble this whole tunnel cover pop it off so we can see where we're gonna be mounting these and then we'll be able to mark it out and cut off that lip off of this uh, channel right here so this also comes with all of the hardware you need. Pretty much it's going to go like this. And these pop in there. Goes like that. And then the lock nuts just attach like that and it gets clamped down to your rails of the bed. So I got the first one in. I just kind of loosely tighten the bolts just to see how it works. Um, you put a washer and the lock nut and then this piece gets clamped and these bolts are on 14 millimeter. Cool. Let's get all of the other three mocked up and then uh, we'll measure everything out, the spacing, and then we'll get to the crossbars. So we got all four of these brackets in their approximate locations. I think I might move that one a little bit more uh, inside and this one a little more out. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna go check on the tent and see how I'm gonna want uh, the brackets laid out on that. I'm probably going to put the crossbars in first before tightening them just to make sure everything's straight and uh, yeah, let's go. 
Okay, so I think we got these where we want them. I tightened down all the bolts, put these uh, screws in, or bolts, and the logo right there. And these things are solid. I mean, they move the whole truck. So next we're gonna be throwing the tunnel cover back up. And I actually got some weather stripping to put here to offset this, uh, this slip on the bracket so that it's a little bit more flush so I don't have waves on the tunnel cover. And let's get that up here, mark it up and get to cutting. So we got these rails notched out. Not the best job, but I mean, it's kind of hard to get in there. Just use a grinder, cut this off. So this is gonna be the space uh, to clear right here. You guys take a look. So pretty much it's going to sit like this. And then we're gonna add some uh, weather stripping in there. And let's see how this comes out. I'm gonna go ahead and clean, clean all this off and apply this uh, rubber foam self-sticking weather seal. I got the 3 8 wide by 7 16 thick pretty much and it's supposed to compress down to 3 16 that's about the thickness of this so hopefully it'll be somewhat flush. Alright guys so we got the tunnel cover uh, attached back in the bed and this is what we did we put a weather strip to offset this uh, bracket and it's sturdy I'm gonna trim this a little bit the weather stripping maybe I'll just leave it, it doesn't bother me too much but uh, yeah so now I'm gonna get these back on I took these off it was a little hard to get this in and work with it so I'm gonna get these bars back on here and I'll show you guys the final product what it looks like and how it functions and everything else okay so we got the crossbars reattached and everything is secure let's see how this works so the 8 inch clears this perfectly that's why I opted for that instead of the 5 inch I believe it's a 5 and an 8 inch There you go. Perfect. So it's nice and sealed all the way around. I'm still gonna add a little piece of weather strip in the back, or maybe not. There's already one that's pretty good. And there you guys have it. This is what it looks like. All right, so the Billy bars are installed. They're secured solid the tunnel cover is back on and it looks like it came out awesome I haven't seen anyone do this yet so hopefully this video helps you guys out if you have a low profile uh, tunnel cover and you want to make these work with it and also these come with holes on the side that's for attaching molly panels that Billy Bars carries probably gonna get those next and uh, Try mounting the tent on probably another day already and the reason I went with the 8 inch as you guys seen it opens up fairly easy no problems there it clears it the 5 inch you could still do it but it's probably a little bit tougher to open and close and also this is gonna give a really flush look with the top of the tent it shouldn't be over the top of this roof but a little bit lower maybe and it looks good so if you guys want to pick up a set of billy bars make sure you guys check out the link in the description and don't forget to like this video and if you guys want to see upcoming videos make sure you subscribe peace